Fantastic. Today I'm really really excited because I am making tiny food, but not just any tiny food I'm making pop and cooking and not just one pop and cooking I think I'm gonna make six or seven and make a tiny food feast and then at the end of the video I'm gonna try them all and have a little tiny food mukbang mukbang. I'm super excited. So here they are <laughs> I'm not gonna make all these, I'm gonna save some for the future. Cause I got like a pack of 10, but I am gonna make a bunch. So I'm gonna make ramen, tiny little ramen y'all. I'm gonna make a tiny little damn cheeseburger and fries. <laughs> I'm gonna make a tiny little pizza. Tiny little sushi. <laughs> I hope it doesn't taste like pussy. Cute little ice cream cone, so to <laughs> I'm also gonna make this panda, I think it's like Asian food, donuts as well. This is gonna be quite the video. So sit back, relax, and watch me enjoy make tiny food. So I got seven here. Fun fact, I've never made a pop and cook in any of these or tasted any of them. So I have no clue what they taste like or how to do it. And I think all the directions are in another language. So I think I'm gonna have to Google them, but that's okay. Just be grateful we have resources to Google things. Like how to make tiny food. Like where would you be without that? People in the year 100 had to eat with a stick. Oh, eat my shit. Okay, I think first I'm gonna go with the donuts. So, by the way, if you guys notice my really crusty fingers during the video, they're crusty because they're crusty and I chew them and they're really dry. So, ignore that. Okay, so I forgot to start the camera. <laughs> All I did was I opened this and let's see what's inside. A bunch of packets. Oh my gosh, packets. It's Christmas. What'd you get, Billy? I got a packet. Oh my god. That's so much better than an avocado. Okay, so first up we gotta cut off this little thing. It's a little water scooper. Well, guess what? I forgot to put the camera on again, but all I did was I added four of these little cups of water into there, into the bowl. See, it's in there. Now I have to add this yellow one, and this is gonna make the vanilla like custard donut. <gasps> oh, oh my goodness. Oh, yes. Let me smell it. Oh my god. Okay, it smells like good, but really processed, but also delicious, because I like processed. That's like my thing. <laughs> I like my lettuce processed. <laughs> now we just mix this up with the water until it becomes doughy. In your face. In so this smells so good, I literally just want to eat it right now. But I'm not going to, because I'm a person that has the talent of self-control sometimes. Okay, so now we're basically going to do the same thing with the chocolate one. In your mouth. Not gonna shake my piss, I'm thinking something more down south. No, this ain't about my pussy, this about my buns. You we move on to the next step, y'all. Now we're gonna shape them. I'm so excited for this part. I don't know why it looks so satisfying. Oh my goodness. <laughs> okay, so I'm just pushing the little balls in and forming my donut. This is probably one of the most exciting things I've ever done. <gasps> oh, oh, that's ugly. <laughs> Go back, <laughs> squish it more. Oh, much better. It's actually pretty. Okay, I can deal with that. The most perfect hole in all the land besides my anus. Okay, now I'm not going to use this one because I don't want that weird ass shape. I feel like that's not going to turn out well. So I'm just going to do both in this one. It's going to be much cuter. Okay. Mmm. Yo, it has a vagina. <laughs> Go back. I think that's better. So now it's time for the sauces. We're gonna make our vanilla sauce, which I'm just pouring into here with a little cup of water. <laughs> water. Let's see if it becomes a sauce. Gonna feel it miles away, but bitch, don't try to okay, the vanilla sauce is done. It looks amazing. And now we're gonna make the strawberry crunch sauce. Okay, there's strawberry powder. A little cup of this. Mix it up. It's a big fat crack, but it ain't in the So now it's the fun part, you guys. It's time to decorate. So I'm gonna take the little bag they gave me and fill it up with my strawberry frosting. This is so cute. I don't know why. It makes me feel like a mouse. Like I literally feel like a little mouse right now. Would you like a slice of cheese? Yes, I would. I'm a mouse. Oh my goodness, this is so full. <laughs> This is so full, you guys. Okay, so I have my little donuts here. Oh my god, it's so cute. I'm gonna put the vanilla cream stuff on top of the chocolate one. My anus hole is gonna open up and swallow your turd. Let me add a little bit of sprinkles. And now for the vanilla one, we're gonna use the strawberry frosting. So I just cut off a little piece of plastic from there. Oh my god. <gasps> How cute!
Picasso who? Mona Lisa who? I'm gonna add a few little sprinkles. Nothing crazy. Okay, oh my God, you guys, my donuts are done. They are perfection. I'm gonna put them in the fridge until the end of the video when I taste everything, but I cannot wait to eat this. Next up, we're gonna make pizza. Oh my goodness, I'm really excited for this one because I've never seen anyone make this online. I'm sure that y'all have, but I just, I haven't seen it yet. Ooh, more powder. Okay, so I'm taking my pizza crust powder. And I'm just gonna pour it into the big tray. It smells like nothing. <laughs> Emptiness. <laughs> One, two, three, four. We're just gonna mix this up. Spark it, pop it, anus, drop it, ass cheek. I basically made dough and it literally feels like pizza dough. It actually does, kind of stretchy, well a little bit. So now I'm just gonna place my dough on this and this little circle is gonna guide me to make the perfect tiny pizza crust. Earthquake, flip it, flip it, asshole clip it. So now I'm gonna put this on a microwavable plate and put it in the microwave for 60 seconds. Let's hope it turns out good. <laughs> oh my God, it literally turned into like a cookie or bread or something. <gasps> okay, so now we're gonna make the cheese. I honestly thought the cheese would just come in like a packet, like, you know, like dehydrated shredded cheese or something like that, but no, we're gonna make it. <laughs> Smells a little cheesy, a little questionable. Okay, so now I'm just adding one triangle cup of water. This is turning into like a crumbly cheese. It looks like feta or something or, <laughs> wait, let me smell it close up. Oh my gosh, okay, it smells like a burnt cheese. it Like it literally smells like a burnt cheese. it Okay, so now I'm just gonna put my cheese on here. And I'm supposed to cut it into small pieces, but I don't see how I'm gonna cut this. I don't know. You know what? I think that I'm supposed to let it dry out and cut it afterwards. So I'm just gonna leave that for a little bit. Okay, so this is our tomato sauce mix. Gonna put it in and add two little cups of these. Wait, y'all, I smell a fart. <laughs> oh my God, it smells like a, like a tomato fart. <laughs> Are you even a real tomato? Are you made from natural juices? Oh my God, you guys, there's sausages in this. You can make sausages for the topping. So I'm supposed to carefully cut the sausage bag for some reason. I think we're gonna use the bag. Oh my God, I just smelled it. <laughs> now that's a fart. But that's like a dick fart, like that came out of a dick. Pour this in. Oh my God, there is. I've never smelled something like that. Literally, the only thing that I can think of to describe it is dick fart. Okay, I'm pouring two of these. Oh my God, you guys, it is so strong. The smell, the odor. Okay, so we got our sausage paste and we're gonna put it back into our powder bag and we're gonna use that as a pastry bag, I guess. Now we're gonna cut our cheese, which actually has dried up a lot. <laughs> now it's time to put our toppings on our pizza. So we got our sauce. How exciting. Spread that around. Now we're gonna add our pieces of cheese. I'm just gonna kinda drop it on top. It is cheek, earthquake, get it? Okay, and now we are gonna squeeze on some sausage. <laughs> Squeezing sausage has always been my culinary dream. Oh my God. <gasps> Y'all, it's taking a shit. <laughs> oh my God. Okay, I'm gonna pop this in the microwave for a little bit till it's melted. Let's see what happens. Oh my God. I put it in for like 15 seconds and it melted like cheese. What? Oh my gosh, I'm actually kind of excited to taste it besides the little sausage pieces. <laughs> I'm gonna put this in the fridge, set it aside, and make the rest of our poppin' cookings. Also, I've decided not to make the panda one today because I'm already making six. So I think that I'm just gonna keep it at six today, but in the future, I'm for sure gonna make this. So next up, I'm gonna make sushi. And I'm so excited for this one because those little caviar things look so fun to make. Let's see what's inside. Oh, it's so pretty. Bunch of stuff. Oh my, this has a lot of packets. Oh my God. Y'all, can I pop a pimple with this? Just suck the pus out? <laughs> okay, so first we're gonna make the sushi rice. We're just gonna pour this into here. So I'm just gonna use my little squirty thing and get some water up. Okay, this smells so good. It doesn't smell anything like sushi. It smells sweet. Okay, so our rice dough has come together. Oh my God, <gasps> that texture. <gasps> oh my God, it's like bouncy. It's like my ass. <laughs> Yes! Okay, so now we're gonna make something called sweet eggs. I think it's like the yellow little thing on top. <gasps> Ooh! Oh, it's so pretty. Mix that up. Apparently in like three minutes, the gelatin will set. Now we're gonna make tuna. <laughs> tuna is one of my least favorite foods. My mom loves canned tuna, so I grew up around it, but I cannot. Okay, so I'm supposed to add water up to the line again. Now I'm gonna take my tuna powder. It does not smell like tuna, it smells like grape. Oh my God, oh happy day. Slay me fake tuna. Okay, so I'm just gonna flatten that and wait for that one to set as well. Let's see if the yellow one's good. 
<gasps> oh, it's getting hot, you guys. Okay, so now we're gonna make the seaweed. So apparently it's just this. Like, is that enough? I feel like that's not enough. Oh my god, it smells like grape taffy. <gasps> we're supposed to use this part of the bag here, squish it onto that, and make that shape. It's super like squishy and it's not like hard to work with. <laughs> I'm really hard to work with. I need an anal bleacher in my dressing room at all times. Okay, so there's our seaweed. Okay, so now I'm gonna make those little, those little caviar things. I'm so excited for this part. This has been like my life goal right now for the last hour. <laughs> I have to fill up both of these to their line with water. I have to add this green one to section A. Mix that up a bit. And I'm gonna add this one to section B. Ooh, so orange. Okay, so now we have to suck in the orange stuff and drop it like one drop at a time into this and it's gonna make little, little balls. Let's try this. Oh my God. Ah! Oh my God, I did it. Okay, it did it. Oh my god, y'all life is so great. Wet it, pet it, ask him, get it, ass cheek, earthquake, ass cheek, earthquake. <gasps> oh my god, they're so cute. Oh my goodness, they're dancing. Okay, so now I'm gonna form these sushis. Okay, so I'm gonna cut the yellow gelatin in half. Whoa, that is pure, like, jelly. <gasps> oh my gosh! I take a little bit of rice here, little ball, roll it around a little bit. Oh my gosh! And we're gonna do the same with our tuna. Lay our little tuna on top. Oh no. Oh my goodness. Stay together. Like Noah Cyrus' song. So now I'm gonna take the rest of my rice and now take our seaweed and wrap it around. Beautiful, kind of. We're just gonna fish out our little, oh my god, our little caviars. Oh my goodness. Earthquake. Twerk it in my face. Do y'all think I did good? I think I did good. Okay, so I'm gonna put this in the fridge, taste them later. I cannot wait to taste that one. I think it's gonna taste amazing. Next up, we're gonna make ice cream. This one looks pretty simple, so I'm very confident that I can do it well. Oh my god, a wafer! Donnie, I love those. Look how cute all these are. Oh my gosh, a little bowl. <laughs> and two little kinds. Take the strawberry one, put it in. And then we take the vanilla ice cream, and we put it in this one. This one's like really simple. And now we put a cup of this in each one, and we stir it, and that's it. There we go. Okay, so those are completely mixed, and now we're gonna put them into our little piping bag, so we're just gonna fill it up. I'm gonna try to put the pink on one side and then the white on the other, but it might be a little hard. Now white is in, so we got them both in. I don't know if this is gonna make a nice swirl, but I hope it does. Now let's start filling up our shit. Can I put a little cone here? Guess I'll put the bowl here. <laughs> Another cone here. I don't know what these are for. I guess they're just to eat. It's like a snack while you cook. <laughs> How thoughtful. Okay, so I'm just gonna snip off the bottom. <gasps> oh my God. Are y'all seeing this? Oh my gosh. I'm slaying this. <gasps> Thank you, Lord. Blessing my beautiful hands with this steadiness to make this nice swirl. Gorgeous, gorgeous, just like me. Okay. No one really cares about the bowl, right? Also, we got some sprinkles here that I'm gonna add to the bowl. I don't think I'm gonna add it to the cones just because they're so pretty on their own. I don't think they need it. Yes. It's a party. Y'all stay tuned for the end because I'm literally gonna taste test all of this and tell you if it tastes good or not. Oh, I'm burpy. Okay, so we are at the final two. I am saving the burger to last because I'm really excited for this. This is like the iconic, famous one that everyone always makes. Plus, it looks more complicated, so I'm gonna leave it for last. I'm gonna make the ramen. I love ramen noodles. I could eat them every day of my life, but that's why I gained 60 pounds. <laughs> but you know what, this is a tiny portion, so it's okay. <laughs> oh my gosh, wait. I think we're gonna make dumplings too. Oh, that's so fun. Okay, so first we're gonna make the little dumplings. I'm gonna open up this little taffy stuff. Now we're gonna take half the taffy and put it on this little pastry bag. See, there's a circle guide. We're just gonna squish it out. Ugh. Now we're gonna put this on our dumpling mold and press it down into it. And now we're gonna take the filling and take little pieces of candy, if y'all can see that. And um, by the way, this smells so good, it smells so sweet. So this is a very sweet dumpling. We're just gonna fill it up. Oh my gosh, it looks like little meat or something like that with little peas and stuff. Now we just fold it together like that. I made a dumpling, this is iconic. Now it's a little open, that's okay though. <laughs> I'm gonna set this aside. Okay, so now we're gonna make 
the actual tiny ramen. So I have to pour water up to the fill line. Okay. I'm gonna add the soup mix. I think this is it. Okay, okay. Yeah, I think this is soup mix. Oh yeah, definitely is. Mix that up really well. What's it smell like? Let me see. It smells like some sort of soda, like orange soda or something. It smells really good. So now we're gonna take this little bowl and we're gonna put water in up to the line. And I'm gonna put the noodle mix in and mix it up. Okay, so now I'm taking my little pastry bag and I'm gonna take this toothpick that it came with and poke a hole in the corner of the bag. We need like a tiny little hole, just like that. Take it out. Okay, now I'm gonna fill up my little bag with my noodle paste and now we're just gonna squeeze in the noodles. So where is the hole? Ew, what is that? That's not a noodle. Come out like a noodle. There we go. Okay, oh my goodness. You have to do it like fast or else they kind of clump together. Oh, no way. <gasps> Oh no, a blob! Oh, get out of there. Oh my god. You guys, they're just like noodles. How? How? Now we got my last one, the burger! Okay, now this one's just iconic in the YouTube world. Like, so many people have made this. I've seen so many people make it. I've always thought, I wanna make that. So now I am. Okay. By the way, this one comes with burger, fries, and a soda. That's iconic. Okay, so first let's make the soda. Okay, so for the soda, we're just gonna fill this up. Oh my goodness. And I don't know if it's based on Coke or what soda, but I guess we'll find out. Oh my, it is fizzing. That realisticness though. It smells just like Coca-Cola. What in the world? Oh my God. I wanna drink it. Now we're gonna make our fries. Okay, so I'm just gonna add two of these little water things into here. Now I'm just gonna add our french fry mix and mix it up. Oh, oh my god, you guys. Oh my gosh, this smells just like instant mashed potatoes. I'm shook. And so now we have to press it into the bottom because the bottom has this like, oh, french fry design. So pressing that in. And now we microwave this for 30 seconds. Okay, so it's cooked. It's separated from the sides of the bowl. I'm gonna let this cool down for a little bit, okay? Now we're gonna make the meat patty. And y'all, remember that sausage? <laughs> that kind of traumatized me, so I'm kind of scared to make this. It may smell bad, it may smell good, we shall see. So I'm just putting in two of these little things, and I'm just gonna add in my patty mix. So, let's see how this smells. Oh my god, okay, wait. It smells a little bit better, but it still smells like a dick fart. I mean, it's not bad. I'm kind of excited now. Okay, that literally looks like Taco Bell meat, and I'm shook. Someone hand me a tortilla, I'm ready. Okay, so now we're gonna put this into our little patty mold. So let's go and get that in there. I don't really wanna touch it. <laughs> oh, it's squishy. That is some squishy meat. My finger smells like ass. <laughs> Here's our bun powder. Mix it up. You might look really hot. You might look like sheep. But girlfriend, anyone can Okay, so now I gotta fill up these ones to the little fill line. We're gonna put this in the microwave for 30 seconds. Okay, so they're done. <laughs> the meat is very spongy and the bread feels very bready, actually. Besides that, a little butt crack in there. Okay, so now I'm gonna cut my fries now that they've cooled down. Oh my goodness! Now, do they honestly think I'm gonna use this? <laughs> How? <laughs> I'm using this. Yes! Oh my god, that looks so pretty. Done. Those are french fries, y'all. Now we're gonna make our cheese in the little french fry bowl. Work as long as they believe it. Your ass will not be so it smells kinda spicy, which I like. Hello? I'm just gonna squish it down on here, and then cut a little square. And there's our little slice of cheese, y'all. And now, last thing is our ketchup. So we need two of these, and our ketchup mix, which smells exactly like the pizza sauce. <laughs> Your ass will not be so small, it might be gaping. So now it's time to put the burger together, and I'm so excited. So I'm just gonna attempt to get my bun out. Oh, the patty came out easily. Oh my, that is thick. <laughs> oh my god, how cute! Now we're supposed to cut the bun in half. Perfect. Oh my god, I slayed that. And the meat, you're supposed to cut it into fourths, but I don't think I can do that. Like, that's gonna be so thin, it's gonna fall apart. So I'm just gonna cut it into half, too. Okay. Oh, that is so appetizing. <sighs> Lenny. Okay, so we're gonna add a little bit of ketchup on the bottom bun. Now we're gonna put our patty right there and our slice of cheese. Oh my god, I honestly slayed this. And the top bun. <gasps> 
It looks like a tiny burger. Am I right? It looks beautiful. Okay, y'all, I got my mini palm tree in. I'm ready to taste all this food I just made. I was over a hot stove for hours making this tiny food. And I have my platter. It's the lightest platter in the world. <laughs> but I'm so excited. Okay, so let's first taste the soda. So, it really... <laughs> It's strong. <laughs> At first it's like, okay, it's Coca-Cola, but then it gets sour and salty. And I'm like, <laughs> what? Plot twist. Okay, moving on. I really want to try the gummy wonton I made. It looks so good. It has like a little sprinkle filling. Mmm. Mmm. That is so good. Oh, y'all remember those like nerds ropes? It's a lot like that. It's so delicious. I'm shook by that. That was delicious. Let's try the ramen. I'm very curious about this. It has a perfect ramen texture. Here we go. Oh my God. That is a noodle texture. Like that is a noodle. Like I'm confused. It's like a lemon noodle. I'm actually so confused because how did that turn into noodles? I'm. That's actually delicious. Let me taste the, the uh, soup a little bit. What flavor is that? It's like lemony, like like the noodles, but kind of Coca-Cola-y. Pretty good. Okay, let's try now the donuts. I'm the first try the chocolate donut. This looks so delicious. Like, it reminds me of Dunkin' Donuts, honestly. I'm so, I haven't had a donut in months. Oh my God. Oh my God. That genuinely tasted just like a donut. The texture was a little different than a donut. It was more like bouncy. I'm honestly shook. Everyone always looks so grossed out when they taste these. I'm like, bitch, why? Okay, I'm gonna try the vanilla one with the um, strawberry frosting. Mmm. Mmm. That is delicious. The chocolate one's still a little bit better, but those donuts, I'm slayed. I, I'm shocked that came out of powder. By the way, I'm saving the burger for last because I'm kind of terrified. I guess we'll do the pizza now, which I'm also terrified of, but let's get one of these over with. The sausage is what I'm scared of, and the tomato sauce, and the cheese. All of it, basically all of it. Oh. <laughs> no. No, 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 no. Y'all know that scene in Get Out when she's like, no. No, 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 no. This is a no, 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 no. Okay, let's do something sweet now. I need it. Let's do an ice cream. Oh, I'm excited to taste these. Mmm. It was very strawberry y. And the flavor was great. And the waffle cone made it. Yes, it like enhanced it. The texture was very, I don't know, it left like a film on, on the inside of my mouth. Let me taste a french fry. These honestly look delicious. Like, I, I think I'm gonna like these. I don't know why. Hold on. Oh my god. <laughs> that tasted like a very processed french fry meets a potato chip. And I am mad at it. I think it's delicious. It tastes like a french fry, just really processed. Time for sushi. I want to taste all three because they're all different. Let's first taste the egg one. Mmm. Oh. Okay, wait. The rice stuff is iconic. It's great, but then the um, lemony stuff has a little aftertaste of like sweat. I don't know. I just don't like this gelatin stuff. It's weird. This is the same thing. What? Yo, this one is like wet. I think it's because some of these popped or something, but I'm really excited to try this one because it has taffy and it has those little gummy things. Mmm. Oh. Oh. Mm. That one was definitely miles better than the other sushis. Amazing. That one tasted like a piece of amazing candy. We only have one thing left and that is the burger. I'm actually scared. That meat patty just staring at me like, bitch, I'm tasty. And I'm like, no, you ain't. I can't. Oh. <laughs> I can't. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you made it this far in the video, you're a true tomato. That was a lot of little projects right in, the, right in a row and you set through all of them. Congratulations. And if you're still here, leave a comment that says, oh my God, that tiny burger is queen. Just so I know you watched the whole thing. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and subscribe if you enjoyed it for more cooking videos. I'll see you guys next video. I love you so much. Ooh, boo, boo.